The main aims of General Club are to equip our students with skills that allow them to effectively review and discuss scientific papers. We set the General Club up originally to uh, help students develop their skills in three key areas. To raise awareness of, their, um, of biomedical imaging uh, and key papers in the field. To widen their awareness of those at UCL doing biomedical imaging so they could meet new lecturers around UCL. And uh, to develop their skills in presentation, in writing and discussion. As part of the class format we bring in an external expert who's probably chosen the paper and they will help us help to guide the discussion alongside the course organisers to make sure that the discussion progresses nicely through the paper and this helps the students understand the paper in more detail. I think it was very useful that the lecturers were present because uh, they guided the conversation and I think some structure in thinking is very important uh, for uh, students that are in the beginning of uh, their PhD. The assessment is divided into three different areas. So students are assessed on their contribution in class, they also are also assessed on the presentation and finally uh, they are assessed uh, when they write a written review. So we choose papers from a range of different areas. We try to cover uh, lots of different imaging modalities such as MRI, diffusion imaging, uh, um, ASL. We also try to cover papers that were the key papers in the field in the last uh, 20 or 30 years. It was useful for my research because it allowed me to uh, learn how to read papers much more quickly. So it used to take me a day to read a paper and I got that down to an hour or two. And it also allowed me to sort of critically appraise the papers better so I could work out what are the flaws in papers and what are the strengths. So my favourite part was uh, the fact that uh, I came together with uh, all the students from uh, my year and uh, we discussed together um, really interesting and important papers to our field. So we believe that this course is really one of the flagship courses for our uh, uh, CBT and we believe that it's going to continue that way.